Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Taurus. This is just an update for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're not going to put a time on this video because I don't believe in that, really. I don't. Um, so, yeah, this is just a, a message that I have to deliver for you. What do we got? I would say in the near future. Okay, what do we have for Taurus? We're going to get one of these for an overall energy. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What do we have for Taurus? Well, romance is in the air. No way, no way. I see a rose. Somebody may be getting some roses. They may be getting some roses. Roses are nice. Obviously, I like white roses. Apparently, I do. Right, white roses are about purity. But anyhow, um, what, what? I don't know where that's coming from. Three of Cups, and it is in reverse. We are going to leave it like that. This is an overall energy. So the Three of Cups reversed is parting ways. Parting ways with somebody. You may be dealing with a bunch of nasty people. It could be friends that are disguised as friends. Uh, they're not really friends. They're enemies disguised as friends, okay? This is gossiping. Gossiping. These are, this is competitiveness. Um, lack of emotional growth. It's parting ways with some people or somebody. There's uh, threes a crowd. There's people that aren't really your friends that pretended to be your friends. Maybe there's a broken friendship here or... Or something to do with the family. Um, there's the Three of Cups reversed. This party is over. The part it's this party is absolutely over. There's a split of some sort. And I don't know what is going on, but we got the tower on the bottom. Yeehaw, Taurus. So here we go. It's a shock. Oh my god. Oh my god. That what just happened? Looks like uh it is definitely a oh my god moment. Things things falling. Look at look at there's there's the bricks that are falling down. There's it's things falling from the sky. I don't know what the hell is going on. This is a shock. You may be on the phone saying, Oh my god, you're not gonna believe what just happened. When I started this reading, I was going to say in the next ten days. But I didn't want to put a time on it. But I feel like I need to say that now. Um, something is going to happen and you may end up getting on your phone or receiving a message from somebody that completely shocks you. Um, it feels as though, I'm just going to take my glasses off for a second so I can see better. It's like, it, this is a disaster. It is an absolute disaster. Um, chaos. Something is going to happen, Taurus. Something is going to happen where you are in complete, utter shock. Something it has to do with your, you know, I'm not sure with the Three of Cups reversed. Something to do with family or friends or it could, something could happen even on social media because this is a very social energy. There's somebody that is talking behind somebody's back or, or they're gossiping and it's not in a good way. You notice this is in reverse. There's, there's an absence of friends here. These people really aren't your friends. Be careful who you're dealing with. You could be dealing with people and maybe it's on social media. You don't even know who these people are. They're not your friends. Okay. Be careful. Uh, I don't know. Who are these people? Interesting. So what do we got for Taurus? What do we have for Taurus? Somebody's running their mouth. Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands is about... Being on guard. Protect yourself. 
be on the lookout, needing to be, and this is about defensiveness. Now, the Nine of Wands is also a fortress, a force to be reckoned with, even. So, um, on guard, finding the strength, um, something about being alone. Hmm. You're on your own. You are on your own. Four of Wands. You're on your own. The Four of Wands is a celebration of some sort, a gathering. You are headed towards some sort of gathering or party. I'm telling you what, you need to be careful. Because if Tower could even be a fight. If you're going out and you're heading, because look at you're headed towards this gathering, towards this party or this get together, and this could this I don't know what this get together is. I don't know if it's at a church. This appears to be at some sort of temple or something like that. Headed towards some sort of gathering. There's people there that don't like you. They don't like you. You're going to receive some news, by the way, with this card over here. This is receiving some shocking news. Okay, you're going to receive some... I don't think it's good news. You're going to receive some news. Hmm. Ace of Cups reversed. That is lack of love. Obviously, these people don't love you. It's very clear. These are a bunch of nasty individuals, which it's true. Anyway, the Ace of Cups reversed is a lack of love, emotional shutdown. It could be very emotional time. There could be some tears that are shed, a lot of tears. This could also be um, emotional, an emotional black blockage. So there's, I, you could be going to something where there's, where it's tears are tears. There's some sort of tears. There's some sort of emotions. It could be overly emotional for you. You're headed towards some sort of situation where there's other people and you've got some people that don't like you and you may get choked up. You may get choked up. You may, you may end up crying, you know. Seven of Cups. Be careful. There's consequences. Be careful with your choices. You're going to be presented with some options. You're going to be looking at multiple options here. You're going to be, you're, it's almost like you're going to be sitting back and you're going to be, there's going to be all kinds of things in front of you and you're going to be called to really be perceptive and think and look around, okay? Be aware of your surroundings. Be aware of, of what's going on in front of you, okay? Because it feels like there's, there's something, there's some shady shit going on. Oh my God, this is the highest awareness. It is one of the highest awareness. The Hermit card. This is enlightenment. Reflect. Time to reflect. And you are going to need to reflect on a situation. There's no doubt. Time to withdraw from others and completely go within. You need to listen to yourself only. You're going to be presented with some sort of choice. And you're going to really need this is think about it. You're really going to need to think about something. It's you're going to be in a time of reflection. Oh my God, the tower again, because, you know, it's real. So, oh my God, that's what this is. Oh my God, I can't believe this is happening. This is it. I don't know what the hell is going on, Taurus, but I don't like it at all. Because I am a Taurus, so uh, it looks as though we got some sort of a massive, uh, shocking uh, situation that is about to unfold, and you're you're you are going to be dumbfounded with whatever this is. I don't know if something is going to blow up, or there's going to be some sort of explosion or something. I mean, it doesn't look good. And I don't like to give a message like this to Taurus, considering I am Taurus. So this is a shocking uh, revelation or a shocking, the light gets shown, okay, on both of these cards. So something, the light is about to be shed on a situation. And I feel as though, I feel like you're going to be running away from it. You're going to want to run away because it looks like both of these running away. It's like, oh my God, oh my God, I can't, wow, I can't believe this is happening and, and wanting to retreat, really retreat. You're going to be wanting to retreat. You're going to be like, 
oh my god oh my god that's that's all i can say is oh my god um i feel like this happens at night because you notice it's dark here and it's it's dark here and it's dark here it is dark so something but you know i don't know why it's so light but there's darkness here so it's and it's, there's dark so there's some if the lights may go out i'm not sure what is happening um there is going to be some sort of explosion somebody may get um well thrown out they jump is this oh, the light is about to be shed on the situation there's about to be some sort of major disruption okay in the next 10 days major disruption where it's like everything comes crumbling down it really does it's like the shit starts to crumble and it crumbles fast <laughs> There's a higher power involved. This is this is the this is the the uh, hierophant. So this is a godly energy. Believe, have faith. I'm not sure if somebody. This is if you know. This reminds me of the last rites. It looks like this is somebody is is being read their last rites. Um, There's definitely, I mean, the Hierophant is the highest authority. The Hermit is a Jesus consciousness, becoming aware. This is following your gut. This is your, your gut may have told you something was going to happen before it happens. Before it happens, you may get some sort of uh, gut uh, notion that this is something bad is going to happen. I feel like you're going to you're going to be given uh this, you know, it's like sixth sense. Your intuition is going to tell you that something is going to break down or that something bad is going to happen. I think you're going to get the the message beforehand, okay? I feel like um something to do with the church as well. You may it's something to do with the church or a government building. I don't know if there's a government building or a church. You're at a church or something. Um, the light is about to be shown on a situation. There is a higher power involved that is guiding you. Because that is a guiding light. So there's a higher power that is guiding you. It is guiding you. It's guiding you, okay? You're being, and there's a light in this person's hand. So somebody is being guided. They're being guided. Okay, so you are being guided. You are being guided towards something. There is going to be a disaster, though. Something is going to end up being a complete disaster. The Empress. Thank God she's in the upright. So you are sitting pretty. So you are sitting pretty. You are uh, glowing. You are... Uh, Looking very good. Um, have multiple options, like I said. You are going to be pursued. You're going to be pursued by multiple people. You may have some people that are jealous of you. Maybe these people are your friends and they don't want, I don't know who, or it's family members. Somebody is very, very, very jealous of you. They do not like you at all. It could be a group. I, it, I'm, I, I know that it's a group. Okay, in my situation, it's a group of people. Um, but I don't, I don't know for the rest of you. I know who these three women are. I do. So anyway, so we have these three women that uh, are that don't like you. They really don't like you. They don't. They 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 may want to make you cry. They may gang up. This is a gang up. They're gonna gang up against you. You're beautiful. You're glowing. You, all eyes are on you. So, you know, there is some sort of major disruption that sheds the light on a situation. It does. It does. 
You're headed towards some sort of gathering where these people are going to be at. You are going to be, you know... Well, the Empress is the Queen of all Queens. We talk about this a lot, right? She is a natural. She's beautiful. She's nurturing. She's she's abundant. She's uh, down to earth. She's love, right? She's a mother. She does everything with love. She radiates love, okay? She does. She She radiates love. She's just beautiful. So I feel like you are going to... Um, have options obviously with the seven of cups and and maybe that's your shock there is some sort of shock here you are going to be absolutely shocked if you are the male watching this you are going to come into contact with this empress this empress is valuable she knows her value she's very motherly she's kind she's gentle she's tender loving care she's a homemaker she's a gardener she's a good cook she puts her husband on a pedestal she takes care of business she delivers okay um so we got this this beautiful 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 person here this this woman has multiple options she does she does because she's love everybody can see it she's glowing that's why she has people these are haters these are haters so you have some haters you have some haters maybe it has to do with empress ha! it does it does interesting interesting so there is definitely some haters that that are going to want to probably bring you down they're going to want to take you down Okay, they're going to want to take you down. So be prepared to be, you know, but it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen because you're protected by a higher power. You are protected by a higher, this is a higher power. Okay. Um, believe in yourself. Have faith and follow your gut. Follow your gut. Do not let anybody take you down because whoever you're dealing with is this is this is all part of it's all part of your strength, okay, and perseverance. It's all it is. It is. That's what the nine of wands is about. This is about you finding the strength and the persevere through hardship. Okay? So it could be part of the test. It could be part of the higher plan. So so keep that in mind. There you are going to be dealing with some haters in the next 10 days that are going to try to take you down. And it may have something to do with social media or something socially. Um, there is uh, an element of um, choice. Make sure that you... I mean, there's consequences for your choices. There's consequences for your, for your, your actions. So... This tower is is a massive, a massive life change. Explode. Something is going to explode. Two of cups. Two of cups. And it, this is a shock, whatever it is. This is an, uh, this is a union. And this is a commitment. This is this is a union. This is a very compatible union. It's like you are if you have been in a time of reflection, you're not looking for anybody. This is all of a sudden. All of a, the, the tower is all of a sudden. All of a sudden there's an opportunity for to partner up with somebody. You're going to get an opportunity to partner up with somebody. You're going to have multiple options by the looks of things. Somebody's going to have multiple options, but choose wisely because there's consequences. There's consequences for the choices that you make. Be careful what you own owns you with that seven of cups. We do have a union here coming together with somebody unexpectedly with this tower underneath. There's an unexpected union here. You did not see it coming. And you meet this person at some sort of get together. And maybe you're sad or you're crying or who knows what the freaking case is over these bitches over here. 
This is a very wise individual who sees all. And maybe the higher power brings this person to your aid or something like that. Show, to show, show you the way or shows you something or something like that. I feel like this month there is some sort, uh, or this month in the next 10 days, I feel like it's in the next 10 days, there's a, there is a sudden opportunity for a partnership or a union or a commitment or a relationship steps it up to the next level. We have a mother or a very beautiful woman here who is, it looks like she has something to offer. She has something. She has something. She's glowing. There's been a lack of love, though. There has been a lack of love. She'd been waiting. She'd been waiting. And here it is. Anyhow, I do feel like the time is up. I feel like the time is up. Something that you have been waiting for is about to happen. I think that um, it happens suddenly, though. It does. It's like you didn't, you didn't think it was going to happen now. You know what I mean? You didn't. I think you're going to be like, somebody's somebody's planning their next move. Right here. It's like this guy, this guy sees something and he's, and he's moving forward. He's following the plan. He maybe planned the move here. Now he's following the plan. Somebody is, it's like this has been planned and maybe it's the higher power that planned it. Maybe this is divine timing. It's like you are headed, you are headed after being alone because the Nine of Wands is about being alone. And this is about being alone. Somebody has been alone or feeling alone. They may have been feeling alone, headed towards some sort of commitment. This is a commitment and this is a, somebody is headed into a long-term commitment. Could be even a marriage. This could, for some of you, I don't know if you're dealing with a Virgo. There could be a Virgo that is shedding the light on a situation. And it could have to be doing with a deal with a union, a new partnership. And that could be your shock. Somebody could be shocked that their partner is uh, choosing somebody else. Okay? Because this is a choice. Okay? And that could be their wife. A wife could be choosing somebody else. They could be they could be being told that they're that they don't love them anymore. You know, it could be this could be a third party situation, the three of cups. So and it's like running away. Somebody is running away. Somebody is running away or wanting to run away or is in complete shock. So we have a shocking new partnership that is coming into focus in the next ten days. Whether somebody is running away from you, or you're running away from them, or you're running into this person. You could be like a smack dab running right into this person. Okay? Whatever it is, there's a new union that is coming into play. There is. And this has to do with marriage. It has to do with commitment. It has to do with happiness. After being alone and being unhappy, somebody is going into a perfect union. They are. And it happens. It's very, it's unpredictable. It happens suddenly. Okay. I also feel like somebody is withdrawing. They're withdrawing from a commitment because this is withdrawal. This can go both ways. This is somebody that is saying, you know what? I don't want to do this anymore. I'd rather be alone. We could go all day with these cards. I do see retreat. I do see retreat. I, I see somebody, uh, but I do, this is, this is, this is, this is God. This is God. Um, God's plan. Bringing two people together. It's time. It's time for this delivery. Good luck.